Welcome to the One Minute Apologist. One Minute Apologist. We interview the world's leading apologists to provide credible answers to curious questions. When it comes to morals, do moral duties ever conflict? Yes, they do. Uh, ask Abraham. He knew that it was wrong uh, to kill, but God said, sacrifice your son. He was willing to, uh, uh, to do it. So we say, well, he didn't do it. Well, he didn't, but he was willing to uh, do it. So even the intent uh, to do it uh, is a moral decision. Uh, Jesus said, if you love father and mother more than me, uh, than God, uh, you're not worthy of me. Why? Because he is the ultimate. And uh, we have a horizontal duty and a vertical duty. Love God, love our neighbor as ourself. When they conflict, we always take the higher over the lower. They do conflict. For example, when I was a teenager, I became a Christian. I told my parents, uh, my mother reached down by the stove, picked up a poker, and said, if you ever say anything about Christ in this house again, I'll beat you to death with this poker. I had a moral conflict. I love my mother. I, I should obey my parents, the Bible says, but she's telling me nah, not to talk about God. I've got to put God over man. So if you love father and mother more than me, Jesus said, you're not worthy of me. So we have to put the higher over the lower whenever there's a moral conflict. How do we know it's higher? The Bible reveals it and our own conscience reveals it. We know that an ultimate good is more valuable than a finite good. So if we put a finite good, the love for another person, love for country, over the ultimate infinite good, uh, we have inverted the pyramid of responsibility.